Okay, this is uh, the week after we got this engine running. We made a bunch of little changes to it, adjusted oilers, fixed the belt tracking on the, uh, the oiler drive pulley, re-scraped the slide valves, did a bunch of things. And what we're going to do today is uh, try to start this on uh, aluminum gas, then switch it over to propane uh, in mid-route, just to see if it can be done with uh, one person. So, everything's ready. Um, what we have in the, the big tall white tank is the batch of illuminating gas and that is uh, my usual brew of about 15% propane, 85% hydrogen and that is going to be the starting fuel. This orange tank is the cylinder of hydrogen which is going to be used for the flame and relight flame for the for the flame ignition that runs through a, a regulator and, and it gets regulated down to uh, about five inches of water column pressure and that goes to the slide valve cover for the two flames <clears throat> and once the engine's up and running this little tank 20 pound propane bottle uh, has a modified regulator on it and that's going, going to run at a pressure of about uh, one and a half inches of water column and that outlet of that splits right into the main distribution line, fuel line for the engine. And it goes down here on the floor under, under that, up into the gas bag, into the cylinder. We also at this time have uh, water to the engine, so we can run it for more than a few minutes at a time. And we've got uh, water coming from the house. Uh, over here into the into the engine and then you can see the water inlet connection at the bottom and the outlet we got a water overflow outlet right there so I'm going to uh, put the camera down and see if I can start this on illuminating gas and once we get it up to speed and running I will switch it over to propane we'll see how successful that goes so.
just a cap in the pipe. Swap the fuel over. I'm gonna do that in just a minute. We'll see what happens. It's running on propane now. one hit on the governor. Sometimes.
on propane we run about one third the pressure that we do on illuminating gas so the gas bag's not as inflated. about one inch of water column pressure for propane.